the video like yo Ari, what do you have going on and i'm here to give y'all the tea sis yes the tea so listen today i am going to be following a very 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 easy beginner's tutorial featuring this is view fox guys this is view fox so they finally finally we have linked up and um i'm finally going to be finally doing my video that um yeah so this is sponsored of course but listen it's about to get real so pretty much i'm going to be doing my very first um full 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 install like lace and everything as you guys seen my previous video that i had did this wig was already cut and made for me and then i didn't do nothing else special with it so today guys da -da -da -da, today i know i look crazy so let's not talk about that i'm just giving y'all the real me with the real tea from the beginning so y'all can see me glow up and y'all can do that with me okay so yes yeah, so right now i'm going to be doing like a reaction mid action with um life with neek and so um she has a video posted um i this looks like it's probably an old video i really don't know but this is just somebody that i personally know and um one of the first people that was doing my hair and makeup and things like that when i first started kind of getting into it in a way so i was like why not and then it says in the beginning y'all know what my channel is if you say it's for beginners and i am a beginner that means that this should be easy so we hear neek 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 a girl neek what are you, what are you, eh, eh, what's gonna happen? We're here to test if this video, if your method is really for beginners. So we're here to test it out. So what I'm going to be doing right now is I'm gonna go ahead and start the video. Um, I'm just gonna try to look, you know what I'm saying? Because if she got music and stuff playing, baby girl, I'm not trying to get copyrighted. So that's just on the T. That's just on, so that everybody know. But let's get started. Um, excuse me. I'm doing a video. I'm doing a video. Goodbye. Goodbye. Mommy and sissy looking crazy right now. Love you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. Bye. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna skip like this is my whole thing. So, so right now, like I said, I have View Fox hair, and I'm opening it up. They give you like a little um bottle in here, I guess. I don't really know what that's for. Like I said, I'm new to this. Um, here's the hair. It's black. It's curly. This is one of my favorite looks that I like. It's nice and easy. All you got to do is, because I don't know how to curl or nothing. Anybody tutorials that y'all want me to do next, come with a wig cap. And boom. So I'm going to take the little film off of here first. Okay. So now you have this, like, really nice hair. It don't stink. I hate when the hair be stinking. That be irritating me. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So we got this. And it looks like they had this little thing in here. I guess not to make it like fold. I don't know. But what I like about the hair is that I can kind of go through it already. 
and I can feel that this is going to be some really good hair, which is good. Um, the lace part isn't that big. And then from the looks of it, it looks like it might already be pre, um, pre plucked and pre like pre, I don't know, pre something. Okay. As you can see. So we're just going to look at that. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is, um, finish the tutorial. It, it literally takes um, no more than 45 minutes um, if you're taking your time. If you really want something quick, 30 minutes at the max. So I'm going to show you guys how I do this. First, I take my got to be glue and I push back all my baby hairs because I want to bleach my lace, you guys. Okay. Okay. I got, got to be glued in the house. I got that. Okay. So should I put this on a... What kind of brush does she got? Okay, I'm going to be back. Okay, so I got my got to be glue. Boom. This is spray. Everybody be using this one. But you know what I'm saying? Mine's a little ghetto fied because I kind of dropped it. But it still works. Look. Okay, so I got a brush that's not, it's not the same as hers, but it's kind of similar. Like this or whatever. And so I guess she's what she's doing is that she's spraying all of these baby hairs or whatever back. Okay, so I just spray it back, right? Okay. Oh! All right, so apparently the spray is not just coming out the thing. It's coming in here pretty crazy. So I'm just going, okay, we just going, we just going to wing it, all right? We going, <laughs> we just going to wing it, all right? So you can see this hairline and all these things. So. so this is the side that I brushed, and I haven't brushed down this side. The thing about the got to be glue is I feel like personally, it like, it just keeps everything in place. And, like, depending on how much you put on and if you kind of know what you're doing, it won't kind of, like, okay. So, it's going to be a mess. It's kind of, like, whatever. So, I don't want to put too much. Even though it looks like she's not putting too much, she's just kind of, like, you know what I'm saying? But I'm still just going to brush all of this back. I, look how trans... Look at that. Okay. View Fox, y'all doing something. All right. I see y'all. So, like I said, I'm just going to brush these back like she's doing exactly how she's doing it i just want to follow what she's doing because this is for beginners hers looks like it came out right based off of the thumbnail and one i'm pretty sure she knows how to actually do hair i believe she used to do hair at one point so i'm trusting it so far neek so i'm just brushing it back and okay so you don't want to lay down it, wait neek are they supposed to lay down or they just supposed to be pushed to the back I need to know what I'm supposed to be doing. What's the difference? Like, and so we're not going to worry that this is getting frizzy and stuff, I guess. Because, okay. <laughs> All right. Professor, look, listen, hey. The lace makes everything look way more natural. So it's a must that you bleach your lace. Well, I always do. So if you guys want to see a video on how I bleach my lace, just let me know. But I'm just going to do it really, really quick. Get one scoop of, um of powder and a 40 developer and mix it all up i'm gonna keep the okay so i don't have none of that stuff so we're gonna go to the store so come on all right y'all so i'm in the car right now and we're about to head to my nearest um beauty supply store because i look a mess and i usually have a tendency that when i look like this i usually end up getting caught by somebody or something or i just be in a really i just be don't i don't be feeling cute you know what i'm saying so we're finna go to the beauty supply store i'll let you know when we get there um i don't really know what i'm doing i really don't know but i'm following your tutorial to the t Nick. i'm following it to the t I'm gonna go to the store. I'm gonna get this powder, this uh, developer, the brush, the comb, the clips, all of that. I'm gonna go get that right now. So, um, <laughs> wish me luck, guys. I'm just, wish me luck, wish me luck. See y'all there. Okay, y'all, we in the store right now. So, the only one, this is what Neat got, right? This is exactly what she got. I took a screenshot of it. So, I'm gonna get the exact same thing. How much this is? I might only use the one, so, all right. You gotta make it work. And then y'all, I kinda went crazy. I got the 40, the 40 developer. My sister, my sister says she got a 30, but if you have to wait a little longer, I guess the 40 helps it go faster or whatever. Um, I got this for Daniel because I seen this dude with the um waves had this. And then I got this because I seen this girl on my Instagram story with it. But I might not get this because I really I don't know. I really don't know. And I got me a little tiny mirror. 
I got me some hair clips. I got my baby a do rag. Um, it looked like she had an edge brush, um, a razor, and then um, let me see. Yeah. And then I got an itchy scalp, but I used this stuff before, so for eight, that really is good. So I'm gonna get this. And then I got me some combs and brushes that I felt like she had as well. And so now it's time to check out. All right, y'all. So we are back in the car right now. I know I look crazy. And I actually took longer than I expected to. I ended up getting on the phone. I ended up going inside the store. I ended up buying a whole bunch of extra stuff. And y'all, fun fact about me, I am a shopaholic. I'm one of those people that when I'm stressed, happy, sad, bored, I shop. And I buy unnecessary stuff versus the stuff that I need. So yeah so right now um i got me some caribbean food from this place that was in this what's it called a lot it's been here for they say like 14 years and um a lot of people that look like me were going in there and so and when i went inside it was a lot of that too and it was a lot of other people that don't look like me that was inside of there too and so i asked people as i was coming in like hey is this good they're like yeah i've been coming here for like 12 years and i'm like all right so we're gonna give it a try so i got we're not even gonna talk about that because y'all like yo go back to the tutorial so listen i'm back from the stove we're gonna act like i never went there and i just already had the supplies because you know what i'm saying but for the beginners you know what i'm saying this was only 17.99 this was three dollars now if i paid too much for these or too less for these please let me know but for me because i don't really use these often these are probably gonna last me a year okay just being real you know what i'm saying so um we gonna see what she's doing and go ahead go with the flow we already did the baby hair thing makes everything way more natural so it's a must that you bleach your legs we bleach, okay so we bleaching so if you guys want to see a video on how i bleach my legs just let me know but i'm just gonna do it really So she finna speed it up. All right, bet. You only gotta tell me once. I got me a glove for my juicy crab. Don't even worry about it. So, all the baby hairs, except for these front little parts up here. I don't know what's going on, but we're not gonna worry about that right now. We're gonna do what she did in the video. Okay, so. So, I got me a little bowl like this. You know what I'm saying? She looked like she was a glass bowl, but baby, I eat cereal. Almond milk, okay? So, she said, one scoop of developer, I mean, or whatever this stuff is. One scoop of this stuff, and then she she didn't even she ain't measure it or nothing. I'm just okay. She did not she didn't measure this or nothing. Like okay, okay. I'm just gonna assume that this is gonna be enough. That's it. Neek, neek. I'm gonna need measurements. Everybody is not a professional. I'm gonna mix it up with this thingy right here. So this is what it looks like right now. So I'm assuming that this stuff has to be kind of pasty. I just want it to be like all the powder and stuff is gone. Okay. I might be messing up, but it ain't giving me the vibe I need right now. Or is it what I'm using to stir it up? I probably should have used a spoon, guys. If you're gonna do it like her, probably should use the glass bowl, everything like to the D, to the details. Oh my god, I'm gonna need to open up a window or something. Okay, so it's all mixed. Ooh, what? Oh y'all, it's a hot sauce stain at the bottom. I cleaned it out. It's clean. It's just a hot sauce. Y'all know hot sauce be staining everything. So, so from the looks of it, it looks like she's just put it in, put it in. It ugh. looks like she's putting it inside the whole entire thing that the lace is. So inside of mine, as y'all can see, her lace is a little bit bigger. So I'm just gonna put it on this whole thing, all of this right here, and just do that. Do she say how long she leave it on here for? Okay, all right. This is beyond me. Okay. I feel like my baby hairs ain't laying to the back. It's cool, it's cool. So I'm gonna go ahead, open this up.
so I'm washing it, everything. It looks like um, I kind of might have bleached my, what's it called? I really don't know. So um, I don't have no Tresemme conditioner or whatever. I meant to grab it when I was at the store, but my sister had this. And so I'm just gonna put this conditioner on here. And then um, this hair is really soft. Like shout out to um, View Pop. This is some really soft hair. As I'm going through it, it's not getting tangled up fast or anything. And so I'm just gonna get this conditioner just a little bit. So what I'm gonna do is while I'm putting the, I'm working the conditioner in, I'm gonna let this sit on here for about 10 minutes because it is a different conditioner than what I usually use. Um, I usually like either an argan oil or the Tresemme conditioner. I could have swore I had some, but I guess not. And I'm just gonna work it through the curls. Okay, y'all, so we're switching positions again. So the hair is all washed and bleached and everything, shampoo, condition, all of that. So right now, mind y'all, Girl, oh my God, we haven't even put it on our head. This is why I don't do my own hair because I'm super, super, duper, duper, duper impatient. But so far for me, this has been an all day type of thing from the store visits from everything. So we're gonna finish and see what she doing. Ooh, ooh, copyrighted not me, you. Come on, we gonna zoom right past to where she, where we need to be at. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna go into plucking. I'm just gonna uh, part the baby. I should kind of like turn this so y'all can see it. Yeah, I'm gonna put, so besides putting the um, video on the screen like I normally would, because I need to be seeing it at the same time. So. And then I'm just gonna pluck right behind the baby hair. You want it to look really, really natural. I didn't pluck a lot this time. But you can pluck, you know, to your likings. Plucking is very, very important. It helps your length look much, much more natural. So bleaching and plucking is the most important steps to me, in my opinion. Up, oh, stop it. So, <laughs> straight up. So listen. So I have this. I got this hair, um, this wig holder from the beauty supply store, which is twenty dollars. Now, you can be fancy, you can do all that other stuff, and you can go ahead, boo, and it looks like she got the hair still straightened down. Okay, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is we're going to do one side. And so, as I said, I feel like this is kind of already pre-plugged, but for me, I can't really tell. I'm using a comb with a ball in because um, it's all I had, and I forgot to grab it. I told you I was just kind of grabbing unnecessary stuff, but I like how I just washed this and everything. And I haven't had no, like, issues. Is this already plucked, y'all? We just gonna plug it some up. So, it looked like... It look, look, I'm gonna mute her. I'm gonna mute it, because I don't want no copyright issues. It looked like she just plucking, like... Okay. Behind the baby hair, she just plucking it up. I guess to make it look more natural. And she combing it out. She plucking different areas as well. From different port oh my gosh from different portions okay neek wait a minute sis give me a second okay we're gonna stop her because she's speeding up as much as I possibly could that looked it right to me in its own little way. And like I said, I really love, um, I'm calling them Bue Fox. Bue Fox. B-E-A-U-F-O-X. More than beauty. Ah, okay. So remember y'all, make sure y'all go get y'all some. Again, this is sponsored. 
And so um, this is my first time having hair from them. But like I love, like I have did everything so far with this hair from bleaching it to washing it with stuff that I don't even know is good for wigs to plucking it to just manhandling it everything. And I haven't had no no type of, um, what is it called? What's the word? The, um, what's the word? Shedditch, shedditch, shredded, shredded. Shedded. Um, it hasn't shed it at all, except for when I was plucking it, of course. And so that's that. Okay, guys. So after plucking, you are ready to install. So what I do is take my. Computer. Oh, we we installing now. Transition. Uh, so right now I'm about to do the install part. So it's time for my hair reveal. <sighs> okay y'all so right now my scalp and y'all can see i only had these braids in for like a week or two now they still pretty fresh i keep my braids in for like about a month that's just my personal preference because i feel like my hair grows more when it's dirty which is uh tr it's true it's a fact for me so um, right now I'm putting this lock twist and braid oil in my hair. It's from Sulfur 8. So I never use this specific kind, but I have used Sulfur 8 shampoo and everything else. And it's really good for my dandruff because I used to have dandruff really, really bad. And so, yeah. So with this, I'm supposed to cut off the top. Okay. I feel like I probably shouldn't have cut that much of the top off, but it's like a little oil. And so I'm just gonna oil my scalp. Oh, yes. See how it's just kind of coming out? Ooh, it's kind of rigged though. I feel like this helps with a lot of the itching that I be having under my thing. Yeah, I can't, I don't know what that can look like, so do not judge me. Ooh, rub that through. Ooh, ooh. I feel like that's good. So we gonna go ahead and see what Neek is saying. From the sounds of it, from this one part, it's saying that she puts on her um, time to put on her foundation. Um, she puts it on her wrist, blends it in, and then she goes ahead and she puts it on the wig. So we got Jasmine back here in the back. We gonna unhook her. This is our wig right now. So I'm feeling pretty good about this. Like I said, I really like this hair. It hasn't had, it hasn't shed it at all since I started this whole process. It hasn't got tangled up. And I've been having a lot of problems with hair being tangly where the whole day you gotta do this. You know what I'm saying? So this is definitely like, I would definitely like from so far, I would definitely go in like by my own. So She's gonna go ahead and she puts her makeup along the inside of this. So let's do that. So what I'm gonna be using is my NARS um, foundation because she uses toffee and I feel like toffee is like uh, what I use to clean up like around my, bra my brows along with Fawn. And of course we're different skin tones, of course. So I'm just gonna put a little bit, I'm just gonna put a little bit on my wrist like that. I got me a little makeup brush. And just like how she did, you just want to like, you know, do that, get it on the brush, then come over here and you kind of just want to get inside of there. Is that bleach? Okay, so this has the makeup in it now. So now we're just gonna we're gonna press play and see what she has going on. The brush, I just pat it on there. I'm just gonna add this part to my lace, which gives me more of a skin tone lace color. Ah, not doing it. I'm telling y'all, not playing with the copyrights. Not at all. Applying my makeup on my legs, I'm just gonna slip that back way. Right. This time, you know, you see those Yo, hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute, need me. Wait a minute, need me. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Wait a minute. This is my question. 
question. Do she? Uh, dang, I'm not trying to copyright. Uh, see, see, this is what I be talking about when it comes down to these girls doing this. Her. First of all, she got a whole cap on. Where is the cap tutorial, Meek? What's up, sis? Some of us don't know what we're doing, and this is for beginners, so that means you need to go from the beginning. Was this like a lace that she already had on? You know what I'm saying? Like, let me see. Let me just put this on. Let me be do. You know what I'm saying? She ain't show the process, so let me just do that. And so, I'm gonna pull this up. People, I know there's actually some people who actually do not actually um put the cap on. It's like a choice or whatever. But for me today, honestly, this time I'm not gonna put a cap on. Like she, did, I'm following the tutorial and she didn't show that. So we're just gonna pretend like I have a cap on. I feel like I really like how I feel like everything like it looks like it's blending. It's gonna blend really good. Like it's just gonna lay on there. Okay, Meek, you might have did something, sis. So, yeah. I feel like a few more, some plucking and stuff needs to go on. Just like a little bit more in a few areas. It depends on your own liking of it. But I like how it's already kind of like blended really good. So, that's good. This is the hair on me. It's up to you how you want your hair. If you want a middle part or if you're going to go with a, you know, a side part. It's kind of really up to you, but I really like this. I'm really a fan of like black curly hair. It just always fits me, it goes with my outfits. Like I said, I always do bright colors. Whew. Okay, so we're not gonna do the whole, we're not gonna do a lace. We're not gonna do a, um, a wig cap this time because she didn't. She has a wig cap on. Ooh, y'all, look at that, wait a minute. personal preference I feel like a little bit I feel like a little bit more plucking needs to be done my sorry y'all if I keep looking over this way that's where my mirror is at okay so now I guess it's time for us to do like the glue and all that stuff so because I don't have a cap on I have to be careful not to get it so I'm just gonna do it kind of like in front of it I already feel like my hairline is receding I feel like my forehead used to be here but I really do not know but I wear a lot of wigs I've been wearing wigs probably like for a year straight, maybe a couple. I don't really know. But I still feel cute, so that's the matter of the day. If you know anything that's going to help me, any tips, send them to me. But let's get back to it. So, got to be free. Am I got to be blue in the black one? I'm just going to put it on my hand. I don't want to get out of that. So you see me struggling. But I'm just going to put it on my hand, mix it with the freeze, and maybe I'm going to rub it on my hair. I'm just going to do it. Ah! We're gonna stop right there. So she is using her got to be glued, um, the invisible inv is this invincible or invisible? Okay, we're just gonna say got to be glued, styling gel, and she's using the free spray. She's putting it on her wrist, she's putting it on her hand, and then she's putting the spray on there well, and then she's putting it along her hairline. I guess it doesn't matter what you use for the hairline because it looks like she's using like an older, like a makeup brush or whatever. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna use my ball pen in because it's not a rat tail comb. It's not like, ugh. so yeah. So 
But let's go ahead and get this party started. Y'all don't mind my broken thing. That's so ghetto. I know. But mind your business. Mind your business. Ooh, she said it's gonna be lit. Let's make it lit. So I'm gonna get up close and personal for y'all. Remember, I am not a professional. This is like my second attempt. This is my first time following a tutorial with you guys. So I'm just gonna slide these back. And I feel like, I feel like I need to know where my hair is gonna be at so I can know what I'm doing. Cause I don't have a cap on. Cause normally you just put it on the cap. So let's say, let's go like right about here. Let's take that. I'm gonna pull this back. Yeah, I feel like that's bleaching hair. I don't know. I'm taking it out tomorrow because I'm supposed to. I have a hair appointment tomorrow, but I wanted to try this to see because my other lace was coming off of my head. You know what I'm saying? Cause I had her put on a small coat, quote, I mean a small coat or whatever. And I know you're supposed to just keep this on until it's tacky. So it'll probably like turn clear or something. I'm just gonna go over it a few times cause you want it to stick. You know what I'm saying? This is just supposed to last me to the end of the day, but I sweat a lot in my hair and I sweat a lot on my face. So like I have to like kind of I have to do some things like a little different, but I'm trying to follow hers down to a T, so. Okay. All right. I just feel like I should use the whole thing. Ooh. Okay, Ari, that's enough. You're doing too much now. Am I? No, not enough. I need more. I need more. Okay. So now I'm gonna plug up my blow dryer and I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna blow dry this down. Wait, do she blow dry it down? I gotta mute it. I'm not playing with y'all. Okay. Put on your hairline. Good. Okay. Got the mirror up. All right. She looks so concentrated. Blow your eyes up, be really tacky, guys. You don't want to put it on You want to make it a little tacky, so it'll stick better. Okay, so we want to blow dry it so that way it can dry and it can be tacky because I guess you don't want it on there. <laughs> Y'all, my arm's tired. It's still wet. Like, I feel like it's still wet. It's still wet. And I need to do it. I need to get it dry. Let me, I'm gonna watch a little bit more so I can know what the next step is so I can see if I can kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Okay, ma'am. I'm not gonna play with y'all on this music now. Nice and slick. Ooh, wait, hold on. How do we get there? Then I'm going to pull my legs up and just take a brush and brush my hair back. This is going to kind of get the legs to stick in all places without, you know, just making it look really, really nice and slick. As you guys can see, it's starting to green already and I can feel it sticking. It just looks pretty already, you guys. I'm really, really, really impressed. As you guys can see, I could have plucked a little bit more, but this was just to my likings. And I'm just going to blow dry it. 
my hair is a little bit dry, you guys. Okay, so it looked like she blow dried it for a little bit and then she came back, put it on top, and then she brushed it to the back with the with the thing. So let's do that, right? For beginners. Okay, so far I get it. This it hasn't been super hard. You know what I'm saying? Have I let this dry long enough? We finna see. But my whole thing is that I'm impatient. So do anybody got a tutorial for girls who are impatient? And you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna turn towards the mirror so I can see kind of what's going on, y'all. So Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, sis. Wait a minute. I can feel it a little bit. I can still stick it a little bit. <sighs> Y'all might I, listen, it's not gonna be as perfect or as put together as hers because like I said, I am a beginner beginner. Okay, but we might be talking about something if it's already, you know what I'm saying? I can feel it sticking and everything already too. Boom, period. All right, is it sticking or am I tripping? I'm tripping. That's what I'm doing. That's really what's going on. I usually use Ghost Bond, but I didn't have that today. And that's kind of irritating me because I really would prefer like a Ghost Bond. Um, so, yeah, so these are on here. I just feel like it's not staying down as I would like it, and that's why I do kind of like Ghost Bond, but I honestly don't know where mine's at, and I'm trying to debate, do I need to go back to the store, or do I kind of like let this dry on its own? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do what she's doing, and she kind of just let it dry. She blow dried it. Because I guess, I don't know, I really don't know. But it looks like she's taking this part over here. So let's see, she's taking these baby hairs. She's taking this stuff. She's pushing this to the back. And it looks like she sprayed it with her got to be, with her got to be glue. That look like it's in my head, ooh. So, we gonna do the same thing, shoot. Then we gotta tell me once, what's up? Sis, I wanna get my hair done. maybe up here but um at the end i feel like that's something that what's it called um i'm gonna go ahead and tie my hair up too oh oh my god no look easy to come out too okay you five i hope i say your name right if i'm saying it wrong i'm so sorry but all i can say is forget the name the hair is good that's what i like about it okay and i'm not just saying that because it's sponsored because if it was bad hair i wouldn't do a video about it so I just wanna make sure that y'all know that about me. But so um 
I'm gonna go and get my wrap and I'm gonna wrap it up and when I come back then we're gonna finish the tutorial and everything like that so I'm gonna give this about five to ten minutes like she said and we'll be back so yeah okay y'all so we're back and we're actually at the same part as her so let's see what she's doing let's play it it is time to cut this lace it's time to cut this lace okay 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 i'm gonna mute her and we're gonna play it she just cut it in the middle her lace was a bit oh All that hard work. All that hard work for nothing. I'm heated. I'm 17, 38. Okay, we can fix this boy. They got the wrong one. Tuh. They thought. So I end up cutting the lace too high, y'all. I'm kind of aggravated, but it's okay. We not even took. The devil ain't gonna get us today. We gonna keep going. We gonna fix it at the end. So, I cut it that too, what's it called? But, I was just gonna do the rest of this stuff. Oh, am I doing this wrong or right? I can't tell what I'm doing. So, yeah, I'm gonna face y'all towards the mirror like she did in her video. Excuse me, like, and yes, I'm doing it on my phone, my business. And the mirror dirty. Ugh, okay. So we just gone. I feel like I'm lifting up. <laughs> no. 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 I'm not quitting on this. No. I just need it to be somewhat presentable. From a far away. I'm gonna have to do like a middle. A bang like this. You see what I'm saying? Because up close, y'all, look at that. That is not what it's supposed to look like. It don't look like hers. What the heck? No. It was supposed to be. I was doing so good. It was. too confident i'm honestly i don't feel too confident about my mid my front i feel like i'm more confident about my sides a little bit but not even so what i'm gonna do is we're still gonna eat. we're gonna just do in the middle okay y'all so this is just not going how i wanted to go but um this is a dollar 99 I feel like it's a good tutorial. I just feel like maybe I missed something. Is it the hair cap? Like I missed something. I think maybe not having a hair, I don't really know. I missed something though. Something is off. Or was my scissors too big? Should I have used a smaller one? Cause I didn't have a smaller one. It's up to you how you want your baby hairs. Everybody is different. Everybody don't know how to do baby hairs. And that is okay. Because I don't know how to do baby hairs. But I know how to fake it. One thing about me, when it comes down to these looks, Eric can do a little fakey fakey, okay? And I'm what I'm trying to do is I want to cover up, listen, let's cover up all this shenanigans. 
Listen, you don't want to lay down. Let's put you up there. Then let's lay you back down this way. Okay, y'all, so this is just not going how I wanted to go. But um, this is $1.99. I feel like it's a good tutorial. I just feel like maybe I missed something. Is it the hair cap? Like, I missed something. I think maybe not having a hair cap. I don't really know. I missed something, though. Something is off. Or was my scissors too big? Should I have used a smaller one? Because I didn't have a smaller one. I don't even know. So this is what I'm going to use for my edges. And... The foam that I'm using, because she doesn't show her foam in here, is I'm using the moisturizing wrapping lotion. Um, I have like four different types of foams. This is just the only one that's open right now, because I actually bought foams at the actual grocery store, at the, um, not the grocery store, at the store. So I'm just going to put this on my arm, because I've seen some people on tutorials do it like this. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't. I don't know if I'm about to, should I put them all over here? Should it be like this? Or should it be like this and this? I don't want a lot of baby hairs. Like, I genuinely don't. Let me see. Yeah, y'all see this? Or do, do I do a do I bang? Do I do, blah, do I do a bang? Let's just, let's just see. Let's just wet these moisties up. Let's see. Let me just, I'm gonna just take whatever ones come in my hand. No. Okay, so what we're gonna do for these is we're just not gonna do these. I cannot figure out this baby hair shenanigans. Is it too much hair, y'all think? I feel like it's too much hair. Like this shouldn't be this long, right? Go, go away. Let's comb all y'all to the front. Okay? This is what we're going to do. We're going to comb y'all to the front. We're going to take y'all, folks. Put y'all over there. Now we're going to take the brush. And we're just going to keep swindling, smoothing, and swindling. It's up to you how you want your baby hairs. Everybody is different. Everybody don't know how to do baby hairs, and that is okay because I don't know how to do baby hairs, but I know how to fake it. One thing about me, when it comes down to these looks, Eric can do a little fake it, fake it, okay? And I'm, what I'm trying to do is I want to cover up, listen, let's cover up all this shenanigans. Listen, you don't want to lay down, let's put you up there, then let's lay you back down this way. People I know have been using the phone. Look, what? 
Listen, I'm not playing with this today. This is not for me. This is not for me. Okay. Cause hers is looking, what the heck did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? If you watch this video, what did I do wrong? Was it the cat not having a, a hair cat? What was it? So I'm gonna let this sit for about five minutes and then I'm gonna come back and I guess we're gonna go ahead and style it from the rest. So, stay tuned. Okay, so y'all, I know y'all probably looking like, Ari, how is this gonna turn out? So she uses a um, a mold or whatever, and then she went over with her hot comb. I'm using Ken, um, Kendra's Boutique hair modeling. Um, this is my first time actually using this, so yeah. So like I said, I'm doing the middle part, and so I'm gonna turn this way. So what I'm gonna do is that, it looks like you just put it on top of your head, right? It's a push-up bottle. Put it on top of your head, it looks like me. And then you come in with your hot comb. I got this on 400 degrees, it's hot. And you just, I guess you're just supposed to slick this boy down. Okay, so let's see what she do now. Remember, don't mind my edges. I just, I guess, to slick this part down for the middle. Oh, I like, this hair gets really wet really fast. I feel like this is some really good quality hair. Cause look how wet, look look just by the water, amount of water I'm adding and just some foam. Some foam into it. And the crazy thing is that I probably, I'm just, I really could just finger detangle it. But I'm gonna go in with a wig brush. I did not need that much water as y'all seen. That's the really good thing. That's one thing that I'm liking about this hair, like I said. And I haven't had no shreddage. I keep, am I saying the wrong word? It hasn't shredded, I mean, shedded. I'm slow. It hasn't shedded at all. Hair, along with this video, is sponsored by Bu, Bu Fox. I'm saying Bu Fox. What do y'all pronounce it? B-E-A-U-F-O-X. Bu Fox. So, this is some really good hair. So, yeah. Um, down. I have had no, even with doing that, I haven't had, there's no like hair coming out at all. This is some really good hair. I like how it curls up and everything too. It was really easy to detangle, manage the quality, the quantity, all of that. Oh so y'all, that is the final look. Um, This is how everything turned out. I'm not gonna lift nothing up. But if you, as you can see, with some more like practice, I feel like I have some potential. This did take me about five to six hours to do because of course I'm a beginner. I had to go to the store and get some things as well as waiting on the process. Of course the video, her video is 21 minutes long, but y'all have to understand it probably took like an hour and a half to do that, maybe 45 minutes. For me, I got distracted, had to eat, had to do this, had to do that. You know what I'm saying? I'm being just, I'm just being real with y'all. So um, definitely I would say this was a really good beginner guide. I feel like I can still go out in public with this. Just don't tell nobody, you know what I'm saying? Just don't lift nothing up. Or like, I feel like if I wanted to, I could slick all of this into like a really cute ponytail. You know what I'm saying? I really, I really like this. So shout out to Unique, um, your beginner video. I give it up. I give it a thumbs up. If it was, if it wasn't good at all, I would give it a thumbs down. What I do suggest is that the next time you're in this video, I wish you would have showed us what you did exactly with your um, cap, like how you did it, how you cut it. Did you use a razor? Did you use scissors? Did it matter? Was that something that you had on before? Also, um, if anybody has any videos on how to exactly do baby hairs, you know what I'm saying? Also, people, if y'all selling wigs, can y'all just have baby hairs ready? Because I don't, I can't do them. I don't know what it is. I've been trying to do baby hairs like for years. I cannot get them right. So, yes. Um, yeah, I think it was a really good video. I think it was convenient that we had the same type of hair. Of course, not the same company. This is again sponsored by View Fox. And as you can see in the video, down below, everything, this is from Beaut Fox Hair. If you like this hair, if you want my personal opinion on it, I give this hair a 10 because I haven't had any problems. I was able to bleach it, nothing. It was no issues. I'm able to comb it through, everything like that. It's bouncy. It goes from wet to straight. And that's what I have really liked about it because a lot of hairs that you get, like it's really hard and tangly through. I feel like I won't have to touch this at all. And it holds, it's, um, for me, it's, it doesn't hold, the it holds the water. So 
with me spraying it, I haven't had like a whole bunch of water dripping down. And then it's also still not wet. I've been recording the whole time. So shout out to Butte Fox for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys so much for this opportunity. I hope you guys go ahead and purchase y'all some hair. Yes, 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 yes. Show some love. Comment down below, Team Ariel, day every day. If you didn't know, now you know. Thank you for my little things. I've been on the road to consistency, on the road to, I think maybe 200K. But yeah, shout out to my girl Neek um, for watching your tutorial. If there's anybody else's tutorials that you guys would like me to watch um, and you guys want to do the process with me, because I watch a lot of tutorials, I just haven't like followed through with them or like I record them and don't post them. Hopefully I post this one. Yes, I'm going to post this one. But hopefully this video wasn't too long for y'all. Um, I have a lot of editing to do and everything so y'all can do this video today. Again, this was a sponsored video. I love you guys so much. I feel like I got processed and then boom, you put it behind your ear, problem. Just don't put it behind your ear. Or if you put it behind, just do like that. It don't have to be directly behind the ear because if I put it behind the ear, ladies and gentlemen, it's a mess. But if you get close, fix that little piece. That's it. I love you guys and I'm out. Peace.